Never Stop Learning, week 204. We're gonna take a quick look at the Perspective Crop Tool in Adobe Photoshop CC 2014. All right, so you can find this tool by coming over here to the Tools panel, and right where you find the Crop Tool, just click and hold, and in the same stack, that's where you're gonna find the Perspective Crop Tool. All right, great. There's a couple ways you can work with this guy. I'm gonna actually zoom in on this top portion over here. Now, one way this guy works is you could actually just click and drag with it to define a little marquee area. And then grabbing these corners, you could reposition it to define your perspective. All right, so back over here in the top, you see this checkbox? I'm gonna click on it, and there you go. So this tool is gonna take care of the perspective, and it's gonna take care of some cropping for you. All right, so let me undo that. Bring everybody back in it. All right, this time I'm gonna show you another way this guy works, all right? So I have the tool activated already, and I'll just zoom in a little bit. You could also just find the corner and do a point and click method, all right? So I just did a click, here goes another click, click, and just continue on that way, all right? Great, so that's another way you could work with it to define this area. Now, if this little grid gets in your way, come back over here to the top, and then just click on this option right there, all right? So it gets rid of the grid, but if you need it, just click on it, and while that's pressed down, you're gonna be able to see the grid. All right, I'm gonna zoom out. What I wanna do is continue to grab more of this area. So in this workflow, what I'm doing is I'm just defining my perspective first, then I'm going ahead and defining the crop area afterwards. All right, so now I have this uh, perspective and a crop area going, so I'm gonna hit enter or return on my keyboard. And there you go, so it takes care of that crop, and it's also gonna take care of the pers uh, perspective for me as well. And there you have it, folks. That's a quick look at the perspective crop tool in Adobe Photoshop CC 2014.